Uh, no, I don't really, Kieran. I, I think this is going to be a difficult night for us. Um, I mean, the, the landscape on which this by-election is happening is is obviously very difficult for uh, an opposition. It's it's a moment for incumbent governments. We are in the midst of you know a, well, a global crisis, but certainly a national crisis, a once in a century uh, pandemic. Uh, and that is a moment where you know the country wants to see the government succeed, and so um, you know there is a natural rallying around the flag uh, associated with that. Um, I think the other point which has been mentioned is Mike Kelly was a great local member. He'd been contesting this seat since 2007. He had a, a local brand which has been built up over a, a significant period and it was a very positive one. And while Christy McBain has been a, a fantastic candidate, I think she's been the standout candidate in this by-election, I mean, it doesn't um, compensate for you know 13 years of building a brand, which is what Mike Kelly had and what we now don't have um, in our column going into this election. So I think when you put all that together, um, this is a pretty difficult situation um, in which to contest an election. And we've obviously had some other um, difficult problems with various state branches over the last few weeks, which haven't helped. So, um, yeah, I, I would say we've given it our, our absolute best shot. I, I think Peter was right in, in articulating the way in which we've gone about this campaign. We've certainly not left anything in the tank, uh, but I think it's going to be a tough night.